But Nicholas, thanks so much for your time. I mean, yeah, the stock file industry, a lot mm -hmm. of money in that industry, a lot of opportunities to tap into. Yes. Exactly what is the pro property is stock file doing there? All right, well, property stock file, it's a vehicle to create wealth. Uh, for, 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 for the black community and also, actually it's, it, it is for everyone, but the, I can say mainly for the black community because that's uh, where we are still suffering. And you look at the banking system, it doesn't give us justice because we are still suffering the effects of our properties up until today. No, so sure. Property Stock Fell, it's a, it's a club, it's a stock fell that we created you know, to create wealth. We're focusing on uh, property, we're focusing on land, we also are focusing on franchises. Okay, so how many how many people in uh, the stock file? So far, we have uh, fifty eight. Currently, we have fifty eight members. And profile those members. Is it young people? Is it old people? Is it mixed? It's mixed. We have young. We have uh, older. Um, it, it, it just mix. It is mixed. I mean, Nicholas, the uh, contributions to your stock file, the monthly contributions are pretty steep. I mean, 2,000 rand a monthly. So I imagine that the people who are members are professionals. Yes, yeah, we have professional. Majority are working, self-employed others. Uh, but we have, uh, you know, people that are, are working, you know, they, they, they know that monthly I'll be contributing this. And I think uh, the contributions are going very well because uh, they have a good habit. They pay in advance. Others, they pay uh, mm. three months in advance. I mean, we received a few calls where others, they are saying, we'd like to, you know, contribute for the whole uh, year or even two years. Mm -hmm. But so far, it's something that is doable because, uh, you know, with, with us, it's something that is doable. I mean, you look at 2.1, it's mm -hmm. uh, what people are like, oh, okay, I can afford 2.1. Mm -hmm. But uh, you look at what is happening, if you, I give an example, I said, if you buy a 450,000 house where monthly you are paying 5,000, um, if you times that by 12 months, that's 60,000. And if you times that by 20 years, that amount to 1.2 million. Sure. Now, the worst part is when the, you wake up in the morning, the president has reshuffled. Uh, you know the interest rate. It's going. You know it's yeah. going to literally affect you. So you're going to pay more than 1.2 in other ways. Yeah. But uh, with the property stock file, we are saying no to 20 years, no to uh, interest rate, and no to bond. And how this is possible? So on the property stock file, we have two phases. Phase one, it's a pool account where we're contributing 2,100 monthly, mm -hmm. and we deduct 100 rand for legal purposes and for administration. Mm -hmm. Now that means we are targeting 100 members. If you say 100 times uh, uh, 2,000, that's mm -hmm. 200,000 in a month. Mm -hmm. And that means in five, year, in five months we'll be having 1 million. Mm -hmm. In uh, 10 months we'll be having 2 million. So we're aiming to raise at least 4.8 million. With 4.8 million, we're going to meet as a property stock for our members to discuss what type of franchise we're going to buy. Now, when we buy a franchise, that means each and every member that is part of us is going to be a shareholder because we will register the stock file as a trust or a cooperative so we can operate as a business. But then, I mean, uh, traditionally when people uh, uh, contribute to stock files, I mean, mm. in, in, in tra uh, traditionally, um, yes. it's... Uh, the end of the year, you know, you've got money to buy groceries, or you know, mm. you've got you know money for your 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 Christmas, Christmas clothes or yes. something, right? Yes. So now you're talking about uh, big ticket items. You're talking yes. about either a property where I imagine that your yes. members will earn some form of income on a monthly basis through rentals. Mm -hmm. You're also talking about the possibility of franchising, yes. but there's there's a lot more risks involved in True. the things you're talking about compared yes. to just buying groceries. So yes. how am I as a member protected from the the, the loss? of potential income if the investment goes wrong. All right. It's in, in any business, there's risk involved, but uh, we will hire professionals to minimize the risk. So we we'll also do market research. So we don't just doing things by saying as members, yeah, we're just taking a decision. We will hire professionals to make sure that our initial investment, we get a return. And also the return won't be monthly, but it will be annually. So it's something that is doable, but we're doing it professional, like what corporates are doing. But uh, if you look at uh, the reason why we came with this, the stock fell in co economy in South Africa, it's worth 49 to 50 billion. And that 50 billion, it goes to the supermarket and retail. And majority of the black communities are contributing that amount. So they buy food, they eat, and then so what? The struggle continues. But with the property stock fell, also we're only going to contribute for two years. 
After two years, we stop contributing, and then we take the money, we're going to buy a franchise or a, a property. But uh, the reason for a franchise is because a franchise uh, it has uh, possibilities of you know, profiting from 500,000 up to uh, more than a million. Now let's take for example, we franchising, it could be build it, micro, or it could be any food franchise. If it's performing well, we're monthly, we're making a, a million in a month. That means in a year we could be making 12 million. Now we take half of that 12 million, obviously after paying SARS and company liabilities, we take half of that amount, we pay out to members as a dividend. The other half, we reinvest it by buying what? More properties. But that's not the end of it. Uh, also, when we reach a certain stage where our portfolio is big, we're going to introduce phase two. Our phase two, that's where we're going to buy each other houses. And that's where a lot of people, they ask, how, possi how possible is this? You know, Nicholas, some people might call you a big, big uh, dreamer, but um, I see you have got big ambitions there. How about we catch up in two years? Once you've reached the targeted amount, you're mm. on the verge of buying your franchise, yes. and we pick up the conversation uh, there once again. I mean, that would be great. Nicholas, I mean, we'll be happy, obviously, to have something to show. For sure. Exactly. For sure. Nicholas, let's leave it there. Thanks so much for Thank you so much. your time. Of course, that was Nicholas Mangike, founder and chairperson of the Property Stockfile Investment uh, Club.